So we're going to talk about growth. One of the biggest, most important concepts I want you to get a hold of. So you read Desgupta. <clears throat> you have already, of course, read Desgupta, first few bits of that book. And that set out the basic issue of why growth rates are so important. Uh, you know, because basically growth of GDP is growth of standard of living by most different measures. And compound growth, you know, a little bit, getting a little bit better each year, steady, a little bit better every year for a long time, it's slow, but very powerful. And because of that, most people don't appreciate the force of steady growth year after year. We need to use some math to really appreciate it. So, you know, we'll start with a couple questions. And first of all, we'll notice that they're actually quite related. So one question, if an economy has GDP of 10 million and grows at 5%, what will be GDP after 15 years? You know, how much is 5% a year going to actually change? The next question, if you save $500 and that's invested and grows at 5% each and every year, then after 15 years, how much is that going to be worth? So, you know, again, they obviously relate to very different things, but it's the same basic sense of, okay, this is steady growth. Growth compounds. Uh, and now, how do we solve this question? Well, as often in case, we just break it down into little parts. Each little part we can manage. Not smart enough to do it all at once, but I can do it bit by bit. So if GDP is 10 million and grows at 5%, after one year, how much is GDP going to be? You know, what's 5% of 10 million? And then add that little slice extra of 5% to the original 10 million. Similarly, if I have $500 and that grows at 5%, then after one year, how much do I have? Well, I have five, calculate 5% 5 of 500, add that to the original 500. And then, you know, in each case, just going to do that again. All right, in year after one year, I have an answer. How much is that going to be after two years? Well, you know, two years, I'm going to have the same basic. I'm going to start with a number, add 5% to it, and get my number. So, you know, essentially, you just do that 15 times. Now, again, that's a lot of kind of button pushing. Maybe you don't want to do that. You may want to say, hey, is there an easier way? Yes be talking through that because um, that basic you know that compounding that just doing the same thing again and again is the only fact we need to figure out a whole bunch of different formulas and so you know they, they may look a little ugly but they're actually perfectly straightforward so generalize a little bit say I have Z dollars and that's going to grow at a rate R so instead of saying I have $10 million in GDP and that's going to grow at 5% or I have $500 in the bank and that's going to grow at 5%, I'm saying I have Z dollars and that's going to grow at a rate R. So what is that going to be after one year? Well, you know, I said I'm going to have that you know, little percent increase. So in our formulas, that's R times Z. And I'm going to have the original value Z. So after one year of growing at rate R, I'm going to have Z times one plus R dollars. After two years, now, you know, I basically do that recursively. I say, okay, now I put in Z times one plus R. So that is kind of the new Z value. After one year, I have Z times one plus R times one plus R. So that is, let's see, get my big fat head out of the way of that formula, and that is z times 1 plus r squared after two years. And do that a few more times, figure out, oh, hey, it looks like there's a pattern. Yes, there's a pattern. After t years, I would have z times 1 plus r to the t power. So after 10 years, that would be put in t equals 10. After 15 years, that would put in t equals 15. Um, yeah, and, and so, um, 
Now, one of the things to notice here is actually it depends on z in a simple multiplicative way. So, you know, if I know how one dollar grows after two t years, then you know any other amount. Well, how much does a hundred dollars grow? Well, it grows a hundred times that. How much does six hundred eighty-three dollars grow? Well, it grows at six hundred eighty-three times the amount that that one dollar has grown. So, you know, I can actually take z outside the parenthesis, and you know, again in the old days before computers, people did that a lot. Now, if that's too much calculation for you, and you know, honestly, I can't do powers of fractions in my head. Most people cannot. Um, so, you know, from early times, people have tried to simplify the sort of rules you can do kind of in your head just to be able to think it through in a very approximate way. So, GDP is, we said, back to our early problem, GDP is 10 million grows at 5%, so after 15 years, how much have I got? Well, that originally 10 million times 1 plus 0 0.05, because that's 5%, remember rules of percentages, to the 15th power. Again, $500 after 15 years, growing at 5%, that's $500 times 1 plus 0 0.05 raised to the 15th power. So, you know, I mean, again, I cannot solve those sorts of polynomials in my head. Um, you know, if I want to do that on a calculator, you know, I put my phone in landscape mode on the, with the calculator app, I can do it on a spreadsheet, you know, I mean, there are a variety of options, but, you know, sometimes you want a simpler way just in your head. And so that's the rule of 70. Sometimes if people, you want a little more accuracy, it's the rule of 72, but whatever, you know, it's really, it's, it's just fine. Um, and that basically says the initial amount will double after about 70 divided by r years. So really the only complication here is that now we're not, this is if it's r percent. So we're not changing the percent to a um, regular number. So we're not converting 5% to 0 0.05, we're just using that 5. So if, how much is it, time does it take to double my initial investment at a 5% rate, well, 70 divided by 5, which is about 14. So I would say it would take about 14 years to double an initial investment. Um, if the interest rate is 10%, then investment would double in 70 divided by 10, seven years. At 5%, I just said, it would double in 14 years. At 3.5%, initial investment will double in, let's see, what's 70 divided by 3.5? Well, that's about 20. Um, now, you know, you, you can check your answers. You can calculate. You know, if I said, um, you know, an in interest rate of 10% can calculate 1 plus 0 0.10 to the t power, I said that's going to about double in seven years. So put in t equals seven. You know, do it on your calculator or, like I said, on your phone in landscape mode, um, and you know, figure out okay, how close is that? And indeed, hey, there's a homework assignment. Oh, I love homework. I know. Don't you love homework? No, no, you don't love homework. Oh, that's why. Um, yeah, I know. All right. Um, but yeah, the homework will ask you to check, okay, how good of an approximation is that really? So let's add some complications because see, you might have been in that previous slide, you were like, oh, I think I got this. And I'm like, all right, let's, let's do a little further. Let's go a little more. Um, little terminology that you might hear. Um, you know, commonly, if you listen to the news, you might hear, uh, basis point. A basis point is one one hundredth of a percentage point. So often, you know, in the news, something you might hear at 25 basis points is one quarter of one percentage point. So the interest rate changes from three percent to three and a quarter percent. That's a 25 percent, uh, twice, sorry, 25 basis point increase in the percentage. 
which yeah, I know it's, it's complicated. Um, sometimes people will just say bips, 25 bips, or you know, one base point is one bip. Um, and now again, the reason you and I don't ordinarily work with basis points is because you and I usually are dealing with amounts of money where one basis point don't make no difference, no how. You know, if I got a hundred bucks in my bank account, then a basis point is one penny. So, yeah, one penny more or less ain't going to change nothing in my life. I don't know about you. Um, but if you work for a major financial institution, you know, on a hundred million dollar transaction, then in a basis point or two starts to add up. So that's why, again, the fancy people tend to worry about these kinds of bips. Um, and now let's get into lots. So let's use some cases where we can see these differences in BIPs. So rates of compounding. So I said annual compounding grow any amount of money, a dollar on up, invest that grows to one plus R after one year. But sometimes there's semi-annual compounding where after six months they give you half the interest and six months later they compound it again so you know if it let's say a 10 percent rate i have maybe a hundred dollars so after six months they'd say okay that's been half a year so we'll give you half the 10 percent that's five percent so you'll get but then six months later, you get the other 5%, but compounding that initial 5%. So you get a little bit more. Could do that every quarter, in which case that would be, you know, one plus R to the fourth power. I'm sorry, one plus R divided by four to the fourth power. You could do it every single month, in which case it's one plus R over 12 to the 12th power. You could do that 360 times, in which case it's one plus are over 360 to the 360th power. You could even do it an infinite number of times because, yeah, those mathematicians have figured out, well, you know, in the limit, does that converge to something? Answer, yes, it converges to something. It basically grows at e to the r. If you remember that crazy thing, e, e this odd irrational transcendental number first used by mathematicians John Napier, William Outred in the early 1600s. Jacob Bernoulli, you might have heard, derived it. Euler, mathematician, popularized it. That's the limit of one plus one over x to the x power. The limit as x goes to infinity. Now, e turns out pops up in any number of different places. It's kind of a wackadoodle thing. You could do it the sum, infinite sum, x from 0 to 100 of 1 over x factorial, which again, is not obvious that those two formulas are equal, but whatever, trust the mathematicians, they are. It comes up in other places. The expected minimum number of uniform 0, 1 draws needed to sum to more than 1 in expectation. The area under 1 over x, if I find the integral from 1 to e is equal to 1. Yeah, it, it's, it's a kind of a weird number. It comes up in, you know, one of those, once you, once you notice it, it comes up all the time. Um, again, maybe. Hopefully you've learned that in your math classes. If not, you're going to be using it, so deal with it. Um, Sometimes we write e to the r power. Sometimes we write exp bracket r if the stuff in the superscript is important enough to get the full font size. But, and the opposite of e is the natural log. So if I take the natural log of e to some number x, the result is x. So that's, you know, natural log kind of undoes. It's the inverse of taking to the e power. Um, so, you know, I mentioned this question of compounding rates. So how do compounding rates change the outcomes? Again, you can do a certain bit of math. 
So I said, if I compound once per year, say at a 5% rate, then I get 1.05 at the end of the year. If I compound twice, you know, so after six months, I get 2.5%, and after the next six months, I get 2.5% of the original 2.5% as well, then I'm left with 1.050625. It's a little bit more. Compound four times, I get 1.05094. If I compound 12 times, if I count 250 times, if I compound 360 times. Um, and yes, a little known or appreciated fact, in a lot of finance uh, applications, people still use 360 because it's very close to daily. Now, you know, do, do people on Wall Street not know that there are more than 360 days in a year? Answer it's because tradition, because in the old days that was complicated, and especially in like leap years and shit like that, you know, nobody wanted to deal with that. You know, if you're like pen and pencil and paper writing out this stuff, nobody wants to do that. So, Again, kind of in some, well, going back to the ancient Babylonians, they figured out there was 360 days in a year and then a bit. Again, you know, leap years and all that stuff made things a little bit more complicated, but, you know, that's um, to this day, that's why, you know, we use that kind of or, you know, have 360, um, like, degrees of a circle, right? That's 360 because, yeah, back to the ancient Babylonians, uh, you know, whatever, however many thousand years ago, um, had figured out some of this mathematics. Um, but anyway, sorry, that was a little diversion. So if I do this, and so if you look at 1.05, 1 1.0506, 1 1.0509, 1 1.0511, 1.0512, 1.0513, 1.0514, 1.0515, 1.0516, 1.0517, 1.0518, 1.0519, 1.0520, 1.0521, 1.0522, 1.0523, 1.0524, 1.0525, 1.0526, 1.0527, 1.0528, 1.0529, 1.0530, 1.0531, 1.0532, 1.0533, 1.0534, 1.0535, 1.0536, 1.0537, 1.0538, 1.0539, 1.0540, 1.0541, 1.0542, 1.0543, 1.0544, 1.0545, 1.0546, 1.0547, 1.0548, 1.0549, 1.0550, 1.0551, 1.0552, 1.0553, 1.0554, 1.0555, 1.0566, 1.0577, 1.0578, 1.0579, 1.0580, 1.0581, 1.0582, 1.0583, 1.0584, 1.0585, 1.0586, 1.0587, 1.0588, 1.0589, 1.0590, 1.0591, 1.0592, 1.0593, 1.0594, 1.0505, 1.0506, 1.0507, 1.0508, 1.0509, 1.0510, 1.0511, 1.0512, 1.0513, 1.0514, 1.0515, 1.0516, 1.0517, 1.0518, 1.0519, 1.0520, 1.0521, 1.0522, 1.0523, 1.0524, 1.0525, 1.0526, 1.0527, 1.0528, 1.0529, 1.0530, 1.0531, 1.0532, 1.0533, 1.0534, 1.0535, 1.0536, 1.0537, 1.0538, 1.0539, 1.0540, 1.0541, 1.0542, 1.0543, 1.0544, 1.0545, 1.0546, 1.0547, 1.0548, 1.0549, 1.0550, 1.0551, 1.0552, 1.0553, 1.0554, 1.0555, 1.0566, 1.0577, 1.0578, 1.0579, 1.0580, 1.0581, 1.0582, 1.0583, 1.0584, 1.0585, 1.0586, 1.0587, 1.0588, 1.0589, 1.0590, 1.0591, 1.0592, 1.0593, 1.0594, 1.0595, 1.0596, 1.0597, 1.0508, 1.0509, 1.0510, 1.0511, 1.0512, 1.0513, 1.0514, 1.0515, 1.0516, 1.0517, 1.0518, 1.0519, 1.0520, 1.0521, 1.0522, 1.0523, 1.0524, 1.0525, 1.0526, 1.0527, 1.0528, 1.0529, 1.0530, 1.0531, 1.0532, 1.0533, 1.0534, 1.0535, 1.0536, 1.0537, 1.0538, 1.0539, 1.0540, 1.0541, 1.0542, 1.0543, 1.0544, 1.0545, 1.0546, 1.0547, 1.0548, 1.0549, 1.0550, 1.0551, 1.0552, 1.0553, 1.0554, 1.0555, 1.0566, 1.0577, 1.0578, 1.0579, 1.0580, 1.0581, 1.0582, 1.0583, 1.0584, 1.0585, 1.0596, 1.0597, 1.0598, 1.0510, 1.0511, 1.0512, 1.0513, 1.0514, 1.0515, 1.0516, 1.0517, 1.0518, 1.0519, 1.0520, 1.0521, 1.0522, 1.0523, 1.0524, 1.0525, 1.0526, 1.0527, 1.0528, 1.0529, 1.0530, 1.0531, 1.0532, 1.0533, 1.0534, 1.0535, 1.0536, 1.0537, 1.0538, 1.0539, 1.0540, 1.0541, 1.0542, 1.0543, 1.0544, 1.0545, 1.0546, 1.0547, 1.0548, 1.0549, 1.0550, 1.0551, 1.0552, 1.0553, 1.0554, 1.0555, 1.0566, 1.0577, 1.0578, 1.0579, 1.0580, 1.0581, 1.0582, 1.0583, 1.0584, 1.0585, 1.0596, 1.0597, 1.0598, 1.0599, 1.0510, 1.0511, 1.0512, 1.0513, 1.0514, 1.0515, 1.0516, 1.0517, 1.0518, 1.0519, 1.0520, 1.0521, 1.0522, 1.0523, 1.0524, 1.0525, 1.0526, 1.0527, 1.0528, 1.0529, 1.0530, 1.0531, 1.0532, 1.0533, 1.0534, 1.0535, 1.0536, 1.0537, 1.0538, 1.0539, 1.0540, 1.0541, 1.0542, 1.0543, 1.0544, 1.0545, 1.0546, 1.0547, 1.0548, 1.0549, 1.0550, 1.0551, 1.0552, 1.0553, 1.0554, 1.0555, 1.0566, 1.0577, 1.0578, 1.0579, 1.0580, 1.0581, 1.0582, 1.0583, 1.0584, 1.0585, 1.0596, 1.0597, 1.0598, 1.0510, 1.0511, 1.0512, 1.0513, 1.0514, 1.0515, 1.0516, 1.0517, 1.0518, 1.0519, 1.0520, 1.0521, 1.0522, 1.0523, 1.0524, 1.0525, 1.0526, 1.0527, 1.0528, 1.0529, 1.0530, 1.0531, 1.0532, 1.0533, 1.0534, 1.0535, 1.0536, 1.0537, 1.0538, 1.0539, 1.0540, 1.0541, 1.0542, 1.0543, 1.0544, 1.0545, 1.0546, 1.0547, 1.0548, 1.0549, 1.0550, 1.0551, 1.0552, 1.0553, 1.0554, 1.0555, 1.0566, 1.0577, 1.0578, 1.0579, 1.0580, 1.0581, 1.0582, 1.0583, 1.0584, 1.0585, 1.0596, 1.0597, 1.0598, 1.0599, 1.0510, 1.0511, 1.0512, 1.0513, 1.0514, 1.0515, 1.0516, 1.0517, 1.0518, 1.0519, 1.0520, 1.0521, 1.0522, 1.0523, 1.0524, 1.0525, 1.0526, 1.0527, 1.0528, 1.0529, 1.0530, 1.0531, 1.0532, 1.0533, 1.0534, 1.0535, 1.0536, 1.0537, 1.0538, 1.0539, 1.0540, 1.0541, 1.0542, 1.0543, 1.0544, 1.0545, 1.0546, 1.0547, 1.0548, 1.0549, 1.0550, 1.0551, 1.0552, 1.0553, 1.0554, 1.0555, 1.0566, 1.0577, 1.0578, 1.0579, 1.0580, 1.0581, 1.0582, 1.0583, 1.0584, 1.0585, 1.0596, 1.0597, 1.0598, 1.0599, 1.0510, 1.0511, 1.0512, 1.0513, 1.0514, 1.0515, 1.0516, 1.0517, 1.0518, 1.0519, 1.0520, 1.0521, 1.0522, 1.0523, 1.0524, 1.0525, 1.0526, 1.0527, 1.0528, 1.0529, 1.0530, 1.0531, 1.0532, 1.0533, 1.0534, 1.0535, 1.0536, 1.0537, 1.0538, 1.0539, 1.0540, 1.0541, 1.0542, 1.0543, 1.0544, 1.0545, 1.0546, 1.0547, 1.0548, 1.0549, 1.0550, 1.0551, 1.0552, 1.0553, 1.0554, 1.0555, 1.0566, 1.0577, 1.0578, 1.0579, 1.0580, 1.0581, 1.0582, 1.0583, 1.0584, 1.0585, 1.0596, 1.0597, 1.0508, 1.0509, 1.0510, 1.0511, 1.0512, 1.0513, 1.0514, 1.0515, 1.0516, 1.0517, 1.0518, 1.0519, 1.0520, 1.0521, 1.0522, 1.0523, 1.0524, 1.0525, 1.0526, 1.0527, 1.0528, 1.0529, 1.0530, 1.0531, 1.0532, 1.0533, 1.0534, 1.0535, 1.0536, 1.0537, 1.0538, 1.0539, 1.0540, 1.0541, 1.0542, 1.0543, 1.0544, 1.0545, 1.0546, 1.0547, 1.0548, 1.0549, 1.0550, 1.0551, 1.0552, 1.0553, 1.0554, 1.0555, 1.0566, 1.0577, 1.0578, 1.0579, 1.0580, 1.0581, 1.0582, 1.0583, 1.0584, 1.0585, 1.0596, 1.0597, 1.0598, 1.0599, 1.0510, 1.0511, 1.0512, 1.0513, 1.0514, 1.0515, 1.0516, 1.0517, 1.0518, 1.0519, 1.0520, 1.0521, 1.0522, 1.0523, 1.0524, 1.0525, 1.0526, 1.0527, 1.0528, 1.0529, 1.0530, 1.0531, 1.0532, 1.0533, 1.0534, 1.0535, 1.0536, 1.0537, 1.0538, 1.0539, 1.0540, 1.0541, 1.0542, 1.0543, 1.0544, 1.0545, 1.0546, 1.0547, 1.0548, 1.0549, 1.0550, 1.0551, 1.0552, 1.0553, 1.0554, 1.0555, 1.0566, 1.0577, 1.0578, 1.0579, 1.0580, 1.0581, 1.0582, 1.0583, 1.0584, 1.0585, 1.0596, 1.0597, 1.0598, 1.0599, 1.0510, 1.0511, 1.0512, 1.0513, 1.0514, 1.0515, 1.0516, 1.0517, 1.0518, 1.0519, 1.0520, 1.0521, 1.0522, 1.0523, 1.0524, 1.0525, 1.0526, 1.0527, 1.0528, 1.0529, 1.0530, 1.0531, 1.0532, 1.0533, 1.0534, 1.0535, 1.0536, 1.0537, 1.0538, 1.0539, 1.0540, 1.0541, 1.0542, 1.0543, 1.0544, 1.0545, 1.0546, 1.0547, 1.0548, 1.0549, 1.0550, 1.0551, 1.0552, 1.0553, 1.0554, 1.0555, 1.0566, 1.0577, 1.0578, 1.0579, 1.0580, 1.0581, 1.0582, 1.0583, 1.0584, 1.0585, 1.0596, 1.0597, 1.0598, 1.0599, 1.0510, 1.0511, 1.0512, 1.0513, 1.0514, 1.0515, 1.0516, 1.0517, 1.0518, 1.0519, 1.0520, 1.0521, 1.0522, 1.0523, 1.0524, 1.0525, 1.0526, 1.0527, 1.0528, 1.0529, 1.0530, 1.0531, 1.0532, 1.0533, 1.0534, 1.0535, 1.0536, 1.0537, 1.0538, 1.0539, 1.0540, 1.0541, 1.0542, 1.0